Hi, so um, I thought that I would do a quick update as I've been given a new drug to try, which I googled. Now that is a really stupid thing to do, because at least the leaflet is a bit less uh, inflammatory, and at least you know it's been approved by the British Medical Board. Um, so I'm taking a new one called Tamoxifen, which is um, apparently stronger than Clomid, which is what I was taking before to try and get pregnant. And um, you take two tablets once a day, just like you do with the Clomid for the first, for five days a month. Um, and apparently this one, I can't remember what the word the doctor used was, but it was something that I thought, I can't believe he said that. It was something like more extreme or more brutal or something like really nasty sounding. But anyway, he said that this is the one that they were going to next and I wondered whether it's because it's more expensive but when I googled it it's also help, um, used to help people with breast cancer and it's got loads of side effects um, like um, irregular, um, fast heartbeat, fainting, fever, rattly breathing, it causes liver cancer in rats which isn't a very nice thought but anyway Possibly a good thing that I looked them up, possibly not, I don't know, but it's too late now because I have already started taking them. So um, we'll see how those go. Um, I've got three months to try those before I need to go back to see my consultant. So I'm quite hopeful, but, um, well, I'm hopeful, but I'm not really convinced, to be perfectly honest. I'm not sure, you know, I had pretty much no effect from the Clomid, um, so I'm not sure that tamoxifen is going to make any difference, to be perfectly honest. I think I might be immune to all medical intervention, as far as I can tell, so far. So, um, yeah, that's a bit of a pity, but on the other hand, it's worth a go, and I'd be really interested to know other people's experiences of tamoxifen, and whether they got it on the NHS like I did and whether it worked, because I'd not heard of this one, whereas I'd heard of Clomid, so, um, yeah, we'll see what happens. I'll keep you updated.